big night. Who has been in the snow this week and built a snowman? I hope you've had lots of fun. Maybe you could send us your pictures of your fun in the snow, having a snowman or a snowball fight with your mum and dad. I don't know, or your brothers and sisters. You might have been doing lots of different things. Anyway, this week is our last week in the book of Acts. So, like we've done other weeks, there are going to be some videos down here for you to watch. And you can choose a video to watch and then come back to me in a minute. So, are you ready? Three, two, one, off you go. I wonder if you've ever been on a boat. What's it like going on a boat? Do you go from one side to the other? Have you been on a boat in the sea when the sea's been a bit rough? And what is that like? Now, I don't really like going on boats because it makes me feel sick. I get sick going on boats and also sometimes I get sick going in the car if I'm not driving. So for me, going on the boat isn't fun. But for some people, like Paul, they used to go on the boat all the time. That's how they travelled to different countries. They didn't have aeroplanes like we do now. And in this story, Paul's boat was going from one side to the other and it was very rough. The sea was very rough and choppy and they felt scared. Have you ever felt scared? What do you do when you're scared or worried? Do you go to your mum and dad and then get them to give you a cuddle? Or do you hide under the duvet? Or maybe you might pray, you might ask God to help you when you're scared. And in the story today, that's something that we need to remember. That these, sol these sailors were really scared on this boat. But, they, but Paul, they trusted in God and Paul prayed to God to ask him to help them. And none of them died because they put their trust in God and stayed on the boat. So we're going to say a prayer to help us to learn to trust in God. Dear God, thank you that you help us when we are scared. Thank you that you are with us and that we can trust in you. God, when we're scared or frightened, help us to know that you are with us and that you will always be with us, whatever we do. I pray, Lord, that um, the children have a good week and they are able to enjoy the half-term week this week as well. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I hope that you enjoy your half-term week, and I hope that you join us for our Family Connect event this afternoon, or you can watch it on Catch Up on YouTube. It'll be great to see you. Take care. See you soon. Bye-bye.